uh, this warning about chemical and biological uh, attacks. Uh, did it take you by surprise to hear this also from the Prime Minister? Well, the Annals was, of course, a kind of surprise, but I think the message is not uh, the risk of chemical attack, is that we just now have to be ready for anything, any kind of attack. And of course, uh, the biggest threat we can imagine would be a chemical attack, but I'm less surprised uh, with uh, the, the potentiality of a chemical attack than what happened at the Bataclan uh, last Friday. So uh, let me ask you, though, about, about this. I mean, are you prepared? You say you have to be ready for anything. Um, it, certainly, it's almost impossible to be ready for something like another attack at the Bataclan. And, and, and is Paris ready for, for some sort of a chemical attack if ISIS were able to pull that off? Well, uh, first, the uh, global message of the prime minister is, again, we have to be ready for anything that could happen, and the level of threat is, of course, still very high, although we know that uh, the mastermind of the attacks of Paris has been killed, but the risk is still very high. Secondly, we have plans in Paris uh, to face this kind of attacks. I cannot tell you that every, everything is ready for it and that we have planned for it, but of course, uh, we have security plans for this kind of uh, threats. I don't know if they've been upgraded so far, uh, or lately, but uh, of course we we have this kind of uh, of plans. But we are not now in a in an immediate emergency. Yeah. I think that uh, again, threat is high, and we have to be ready for uh, anything.